All right, so we're back with Spider-Man 2 this time. This is the famous Spider-Man game that I think was the first one to have your webs actually attaching to buildings as you swing. So, yeah, this one's definitely, of the ones that I've played, this one's easily going to be my favorite, I already know. But I'll let Toby introduce the game to you. as we look at this beautiful miniature model of New York City. So they actually got a couple more of the actors this time, which is kind of cool. some of the worst the city has to offer. Sometimes it's just a mugger. Sometimes it's a bigger problem. This is the city I protect. New York City. It's my home. My playground. My responsibility. Okay. Ah, and this is Mary Jane. The girl next door. The girl I love. But love is a tricky thing when you live part of your life behind a mask. Fate handed me amazing powers, and I made a promise to use those powers to help people. With great power comes great responsibility. No matter how much I might wish things were different, there's only one Spider-Man. Swing after the... Looks like the robbers are escaping on foot. Go teach them about justice. You know, by beating the snot up. Oh, oh my god, I jumped so fucking high, okay. Come on. Oh, okay, he hit the awning. <laughs> but I want to smack him into a wall instead. <laughs> oh my god, it's so good. It's so good. Alright, so this will just make it so our swing speed is a little faster. Now the game will start proper. City's been quiet lately. Maybe my luck's finally changing. Isn't it beautiful, Rosie? I'm gonna blow up the city. This will be my gift to the world. Unlimited energy. The power of a sun harnessed for the good of all mankind. Don't forget the good of Otto. Eat something. The world will still be here in half an hour. I mean, you don't know that. The sun could explode. All right. Don't let them get the case. Give us the case and you won't get hurt. Oh my god. Let's clear out of here. Spider. We're going to need more men. Yeah. Got him. Easy. Case secure. Oh, don't just run over your dead comrade like I mean, your knocked out comrade like that. So badly. I'm sorry. I can't really talk about it. All right. 
Well, at least try to be more careful from now on. Don't worry. I think Toby's. I think Toby's delivery got a little better in this game compared to the first. It's still not great. I think he could. I just don't think he cared very much. Dr. Connors. Peter. I'm sorry for missing class. I was on my way, but. Peter, I don't want to hear excuses. You have a keen scientific mind, but your grades are slipping. You miss class half the time, and when you do show up, you're asleep in your seat. Yes, Dr. Connors. I understand. Have you started your paper on Dr. Octavius yet? He's a good friend of mine, so you'd better know what you're talking about. Uh, well, I've been thinking about it. <sighs> thinking isn't your problem. But that paper isn't going to write itself, Peter. And if you don't get your act together, you are in serious danger of failing this class. I know, Dr. Connors. I'll pull things together. I promise. I hope so. I'll see you in class. It's rough, buddy. I don't know why his Spider-Man, his Peter Parker model, is still wearing glasses. He doesn't need the glasses anymore. He wore the glasses in the movie, but that's because he lost his powers for a bit. I think uh, this might be a good time for you to check your computer. Oh my gosh, I'm flying. A gun. We don't like that. I'm going to smack you against the fucking wall. <laughs> uh, join for five seconds and you're smashing people against the wall. Yeah, th this game is, is real fun. This is this is a really good Spoderman game. Peter, you made it. Happy birthday. Hey, buddy. MJ and I had a bet going on whether you would actually show up. Thanks, Harry. Hey, MJ. I'm almost afraid to ask, but who won the bet? I did, of course. Okay, Harry, pay up. All right, all right. Are you sleeping all right, Pete? You look beat. Just some late nights. Still palling around with that murdering bug? Harry, I know you think Spider-Man killed your dad. He did kill my dad. Someday I'll get him for it, too. Okay. I'll tell him that next time you see him. All right, this scene escalated quickly. Uh, well, hey, congratulations on those billboards, MJ. Oh, thanks. Um, it's so unexpected. Everything's happening at once. The billboards, the play, which you have to come see, by the way. I'll get you a ticket for your birthday. Can you swing by later and pick it up? Huh? Oh. Swing by. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Thanks. yeah. Yeah. yeah I, I, promise I'll I thought you knew that I was Spider-Man. So, uh, <laughs> what's up at Oscorp lately? Uh, I'm heading up special projects now. You've been providing funding and tritium for one of your heroes, Dr. Octavius. You want to meet him? Do I? That would be great, Harry. I'll set everything up then. Hey, come on, let's eat. And the last guy, uh, we'll just... <laughs> oh, the ragdoll is so funny. Harry's dad was a green goblin. How could I tell him that? You could just go, hey, Harry, your father is the Green Goblin. Or you could tell him, the blade that pierced your father's heart came from your glider. Oh, wait. I mean, it came from his gilder. I mean, it came from his trailer. The blade that, that pierced your, your, your trailer's heart came from your father. If you haven't seen the outtakes for... Um, the the uh, in Spider-Man three for the butler explaining to Harry that the blade that pierced his father's heart came from his own glider. You should check that out. This this guy cannot get the line out for some reason, and it's hilarious. And hang on, let's find a nice wall. This looks good. Stay right there. <laughs> oh, it's so good. I'm just gonna say that every single time. All right, web up. Oh, I missed. Oh, that's okay. And we got the money. It's ours now. This game looks real fun. It is. If you've never played this game before, I highly recommend it. Watch this shit. Hoo ha! Sorry, I'm running a little late, MJ. I've got news, Jim. It was great seeing you and Harry again the other night. Yeah. Anyway. 
I brought you the ticket for my play. Peter, I think you should know. I'm seeing someone now. A guy. Oh. Really? Huh. Really? Is that all you have to say? Oh my gosh. Uh, I... I have to go. Of course you do. I'm really sorry, MJ. I really want to talk more. I'll call you. Yeah. Sure. Oh. Oh, man. Poor Pete. Um, it just says saw, and did that say Ebola? This game is so fun. <laughs> Cute. This may not be art, but I like it. Who? moves for dork and tights are these yours <laughs> please wait oh ah uh, oh, oh okay Standards, after all. Standard is the word. And here I was expecting... Amazing. Hey! Yep. Got away with the lady, Spidey. Mr. Smooth. There's no way we could catch her now. She must be miles away by now. Who's with that girl? Okay, so let's... Okay, now what? Just beat the shit out of him, apparently. Oh my god. I owe you one, Spidey. You're safe you now. <laughs> that was incredibly violent. I did the Daily Bugle, I just have to get enough hero points. Which I might already have. Explosion. Better check it out. Oh shit. Let's get out of here. It's Paul Giamatti. <laughs> back to base, understood? Oh, I'm already there, look. Take a wild guess that you're strong but dumb. What do you got for me, Rhino? And uppercut. I threw a well-oiled Toyota Camry at him. Yeah. Oh shit! I hope that wasn't filled with gas. Sorry to leave you hanging, Rhino, but I don't want to be accused of poaching. I think the police should be able to handle you at this point. Have fun. Yeesh. You're pretty tough for such a scrawny little guy. Um, looks like the webs didn't really load on him. He's supposed to be webbed up. Maybe I can fix that. No. But you can do this, though. I'm getting dizzy. I can just beat the shit out of him. <laughs> If you want to be an absolute cockbag. What do you got for me? Hi, my name is Spider-Man and I'll be your superhero today. Spidey, someone's car's being stolen. Yep. Oh wow, did they they must have rehearsed that. They were perfectly in sync with each other getting into that car. Perfect. I mean, oh no. Oop, get the bag. My bag of money. I don't even have to beat this guy up. I just have to get the money. Of course we're going to beat him up, though. Uh-oh. Your 
I don't think that punishment fits the crime, Spider-Man, but okay. There we go. Okay. Let's see what Alfred Molina has to say. Let me introduce my good friend, Peter Parker. It's a huge honor to meet Parker. My friend Dr. Connors told me about a brilliant student of his named Parker, who can't seem to stay awake in class. <laughs> I'm sure Kurt has beaten him up enough already, Otto. You're right, of course. This is my wife, Rosie, without whom I would be lost. She is my assistant and inspiration. Come and take a look at my masterpiece. There it is. Sustained fusion has never been possible before. Why? Once the reaction reaches a certain point, it becomes impossible to contain or control it. Exactly. Until now. Using tritium in the core, provided exclusively by Oscorp. Yes, of course. As I was saying, <laughs> tritium in the core lends the reaction more stability. And these arms are the key. Amazing. How do they work? Well, you see, Peter, we don't want to keep Otto from his work. Uh, in that case, Peter, won't you join us for dinner next time you visit? I'm sure Otto would be happy to explain more of that. I would love to. <laughs> Thanks. See you then. Rose's head looks like it was grafted onto another body. It doesn't really match up. Wait, 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 hang on. BB dodge. Hope your insurance is paid up. <laughs> Never gets old. Uh oh. Guess I'd better check out that alarm. I'd know that silhouette anywhere. I'd better catch her. And okay, hopefully she uh, is a little better at running away this time. Oh god. Okay. You could also just try and crash the fucking game. That's also a strategy. Not bad. I actually had to push myself this time. Hand over those jewels you took. <laughs> jewels? I saw you leaving that jewelry store. You know, the one with the alarm blasting. <laughs> I don't have any jewels. Wait. What's your name? Me? I'm Black Cat, and I just crossed your path. Now, if you'll excuse me. Whoa. Oh, sweet, we're on a rooftop? Oh, no, you know what that means. There we go. They're okay. They'll be fine. I promise. <laughs> no, I'm not a murderer. I, 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 they're fine. Oh shit. They were just having a rooftop party. No, they were. They were clearly up to some sort of nefarious deed. And I, as a virtuous hero that I am, stopped them before they could do something bad. That's me. For those of you just joining us, Hollywood events expert and Spider-Man critic Quentin Beck has issued a public challenge to the web slinger. Bob, what do you think? Well, Steve, it's a bold move, no doubt about it. Personally, my money's on Spider-Man. Hey. We'll have to see how it plays out. Here comes Quentin Beck now. And now, your MC and host for this evening. You know his legendary work from such films as Cyborg Babysitter and Fears of an Alien Bounty Hunter. A man who 
has worked tirelessly for the entertainment of all mankind. Ladies and gentlemen, it gives me great pleasure to introduce that master of film magic and illusion, that expert of the unknown, the one, the only, Thank you for coming, Spider-Man. He looks more like Doc Ock. At him. I couldn't tell. Dude, I'm creaming this guy. I've got. I'm in my stride now. Boom! Look at that. Absolutely destroyed. Okay. Oh yeah, <laughs> even the audience isn't real yet. It's it's just a bunch of JPEGs. Is that is that in universe? Did he just set up a bunch of cardboard cutouts? Who? Oh shit. Uh, okay. All right. Oh, that was close. Okay. Now. 
this was too easy, Beck. I guess I should thank you, though. I really needed some good press for a change. See ya. Oh, fair. The fair. He shouldn't have won. All the work. The obstacle course, yes, the obstacle course was good. Oh, the electric cannon, the electric oh. cannon. Look at that. Why, why? Look at that. Look, he's going, he's making a break for it. What, like? what the hell? What was that? What does this do to your theories about the Wetslinger? Are you ready to admit you were wrong? A shocker made a break for it, and that guy's head was twice the size it should be. <laughs> it's like I had a big mode cheat on. That's not good. These guys clearly must be up to no good. Oh. <laughs> Oh shit, no, they actually were having a party. I'm sorry. Oh, I webbed his, I webbed his eyes. Here, don't worry, you're safe now. Oh, I just saw him. Look at like they're dropping in. All right, guys. There we go. Punishment definitely fit the crime again. I don't know what they were up to, but I I think it was punishable by death. It was like a black hole. What was that? Well, I'll explain it over dinner, Peter. Shall we? Um, okay. Dr. Octavius' theories are amazing. My head is still spinning from talking to him. Oh, no. Mary Jane's play. If I hurry, I can still make it in time. No, never. Okay, I'm close enough now. Come back here. What if this is how Spider-Man traveled throughout the city? He just jumped along the road like this, like an idiot. Oop. John Jameson, what are you doing here? Well, there's this beautiful girl in the cast. Jesse Jameson. Someone shoot me to hell. Stalking. She on your naughty list, too. Well, not exactly. What do you care, anyway? No reason. Just dropping by to say hi. By the way, remember those guys you beat up the other day in the art gallery? I remember. Well, it turns out there's a whole ring of them. I just happened to find a hideout the other day. I could show you. If you could take a break from the Pete and Tom routine, I guess. Uh, sure. I really wasn't spying. There they are, as advertised. Get the rest of the stuff in the truck. We gotta get out of here before Spider Man shows up. Hmm. Nice sculpture. Okay, you got him, cat. Eh, no, you don't. Alright, I got him. Whew, alright. Jeez, guns. Guns bad. Forehead. 
I need, I need a crime. Here we go. Perfect. Okay. Crime is good for the Spider-Man's health. Perfect. Perfect. I mean, I mean, oh, oh no. So someone's gonna fall. So we got swing speed, interceptor kick, and the pile driver. I need to pile drive an enemy right now. I need, I need some bad guys to fight. Summon some bad guys, please. Anything I can help with? Spidey, an armored car down the street is being robbed. Okay, good. Are you ready? <laughs> oh man, oh no, there should be nothing left of that human after that. Oh, they didn't count. They were rigged. Okay. This time they'll really count, though. What do you think Vex got this time? Who knows? He's a little loopy, right? Hollywood guy. I haven't done anything yet. How do, oh, okay, no, okay, now they've done something. Okay. Okay, all right, I'm getting shot at immediately. All right. There we go. Okay. Damn, I was close to dying there. to destroy the brain <laughs> the comical cartoon brain and I think I'm dead now yeah well <laughs> all that work okay yeah I failed <laughs> okay <laughs> oh no okay there we go Okay. There we go. Okay. There. Just had to get the hang of it.
um, little platform stim at least one of them's still there. Hey buddy, can you give me a lift? I left my wallet in my other costume. Alright, isn't his like warehouse just this guy's apartment? I'm pretty sure it is, let me see. Yep. Wow. Mysterio's hidden fortress looks just like an apartment. A hidden door concealed by a bookcase? Mysterio, you brilliant fiend! <laughs> well, I guess I'd better check it out. around to see that. Where the heck am I? Welcome, Spider-Man! So glad you could drop in! Hey, Mysterio. A cliché who walks like a man. Silence! Prepare to meet your end in my... Funhouse of Doom! Funhouse of Doom? I thought you were an alien. Silence! <laughs> As I was saying, even as we speak, I am watching you from my hidden control room. Perhaps you can find me, if you survive. <laughs> Let's begin now, shall we? Let me introduce you to my friend, Mr. Hoppin. Such a cheerful fellow, isn't he? You'll soon discover that he is quite the color. Oh, and I thought my jokes were bad. Okay, Mr. Hoppin Hack, let's see what you got. Is that all you've got? Remember the the thing with them is that the more you punch them, they reel back and will attack. Look at this place. Let me guess. You're trying to make the cover of Super Villain Decorator Monthly, right, Mysterio? Wait, what? Why wouldn't you just stick to the ceiling? Did Dave from Coppinfield bite you as a kid? Oh, here we go. Looks like I found the exit. Finally. A hologram. Why should I be surprised? You may have foiled my plans this time, Spider-Man, but I'll be back. All right, sir. Right over here. That's where I'm trying to get to. Okay, thanks. Thanks for the lift. Oh, hey, Duncan. How's it going? <laughs> yeah, you can attach to the helicopter. You doing good? That's good. Don't feel like you have to be in here, though. You got something you got to do. It's fine. Thank you for coming, ladies and gentlemen. But if you want to see, if you want to see Doc Ock try to blow up the city, then here it is. The power of a sun is now ours. The game is really good. This is a, this is a really good game. I played this game a lot when I was younger. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna blow up the city. How's the audio, if you don't mind me asking? Can you hear everything, Gwit? I didn't really test it all that well. I've just gone with the normal settings that I've gone for everything else that have worked. Peter? Sounds good? Okay.
Oh, oh no. Oh, I guess that killed her. So you say you can hear me much better than the game. Is that in a good way or a bad way? Am I too loud? Smack. Ow, ow, okay, I only have one shot. I'm gonna die. I'm not gonna die. Holy shit. Oh, okay. That was fucking close. can't do anything against Martians. Yeah, well, I mean, they're, they're, uh, they're built by Mysterio. Oh no, now some kid's lost his balloon. Get the balloon. Got it, okay. Okay, shut up. Here's the balloon. The Martians took the balloon. <laughs> it was all a plot to to steal the balloon. Yes, bad guys. Okay, good. Okay, some thugs are shooting at the police. You say good. Spider Man's really a monster. He'd be out of a job with that. Yeah, yeah, I'd be out of a job. Okay, but see, I'm I'm the protector of the city. Watch this. Watch what I'm going to do to this criminal. She was uh, she was shooting at the police. So I think that this is going to be a fitting punishment for that crime. Ugh. See? You better learn your lesson in the slammer. Now get out of the road. I'm gonna grab this. Oh, oh, no, oh, I was so close. Okay, maybe not. A little, probably a little more power than that. Okay, thank you, WebZip. All right. Definitely not worth it. I think I'll not do that. Why is Spider-Man so weak to water? Because, I mean, what do you always do with spiders in your house? You always flush them down the drain. So, yeah. That's basically what's happening. What are the spiders that can walk on water? Well, he didn't get bit by a, one of the spiders that can walk on water, so it doesn't count. Holy shit, it's a cool man. Are you all right? I heard on the news that I killed them. All right, Otto, just calm down. Let's call the police. Police? No. No police. Get away from me, you traitor. But, yeah, he wants to turn me into the police. Is this how you would pay my friendship? Oh no, now he's a lizard. Probably. Of course. That murderous arachnid Spider-Man. He killed Rosie. Destroyed my life's work in an instant. I'll rebuild it, though, and kill him. It shouldn't have been like this. You're right. If I am a criminal, then I will have to act as a criminal to do what I must. I need money. I need your money. To build for Rosie. You know, ordinarily, I'd be like, there's no way you could think that Spider-Man killed your wife. But given the couple of things that I've done in this game, I, yeah, you know what? I don't blame him for blaming me. Talking about? Oh, Parker. 
That Fruit Loop physicist went nuts, killed the doctors who were working on him, and ran out of the hospital. Killed them? That can't be. It's true. All right, get out of my office. This is a newspaper, not a knitting circle. We got to meet Aunt Mank at the bank, just so she can find out that she does not get the free toaster. Because she didn't put in enough money. Aunt Mank. Sorry I'm late. Peter, don't be sorry. I was just worried about you. Thank you for taking the damn day off me. It's no problem, Aunt Mank. Let's go in. I'm sure everything will work out great. How about your loan, Mrs. Parker? Oh no! I've got Daddy, get away! Run! Ladies and gentlemen, I am making a. He's got Ock goons. Kindly remain calm and silent, so that we can avoid unnecessary. They all have to have that specific haircut. Oh, yeah. It'd be ironic if he was Spider-Man. <laughs> oh my god, I uppercutted that guy so hard there was a tiny explosion. There we go. Okay. Whew, okay. I didn't have to actually kill him. That's good. Having, have not seen a game allowing you to ragdoll a boss in a while. Oh shit. The the fight's not over. Oh gosh, one hit and I am fucked. Okay, hopefully that was it. Be quiet and no harm will come to you. Yeah, I did the super web. I didn't mean to do that one. Yeah. Oh, oh shit. Okay, 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 okay. I was trying to... I was stretching. Okay. Apparently there's no time for that. Wait, when did Doc Ock have a helicopter? Also, can't I just do this? Yeah. There we go. All right, I beat the game. Okay, oh, all right. Okay, that worked. That still worked, though. Um, Aunt May, just get out of the way. Just move. Gotcha. Didn't need to cut it that close. I got there way before that train was going to get there. You'll be all right now. Amazing. Spider-Man, their costume thugs attacking people. I'm not worth your trouble, really. Everybody better get out of our way. Well, this will our be boss needs money. Run of the mill cooks, I mean. Oh shit, a kid's lost his balloon. Which one do I choose? The woman who's being held at gunpoint or the kid who lost his balloon? Okay. <laughs> they just blew themselves up. I, I, was, I didn't even get here in time. Yeah, for you. Say good night, Gracie. <laughs> oh, that worked out perfectly. <laughs> I didn't think I'd get all four of them. Just made some lunch. All right. Oh, you missed. You missed a real, real good moment, or I knocked four people off of a rooftop at the same time. Statue? I gave it to the cops already. I was just having some fun with you. 
kind of cute trying to figure out what happened back at that warehouse. Anyway, my original point was, why are you still bothering with a normal girl? Normal is boring. Normal is half my life. At least it's supposed to be. <laughs> why? I mean, seriously. Why settle for being some schmo when you could be a superstar? Well... Forget it. When I was going to tell you about Shocker, but you're obviously busy sulking. Shocker? What about him? Oh, just that he broke out of prison a little while back and he's back in the city. I was going to show you where he's hiding out, but... Show me. <laughs> That's a spirit? Trust me, kicking his heavily padded butt will make you feel better. Yeah, you're probably right. Let's go. Man, Black Cat is so much better than Mary Jane in, the, in this game. Does Black Cat have any superpowers, or is she just really athletic? She, I believe the story, in at least the, the animated series, which I'm going to assume is based off of, like, her actual appearance, she has the same sort of super soldier serum that uh, Captain America has. So she's, like, got the same abilities as Captain America, she just doesn't have a shield. So. But I guess if she had the shield then she'd be able to throw it just like he does. Okay, got him. You okay? Oh, yeah. He just caught me off guard. I'll be ready for him next time. L listen, I gotta get going. I have some things I need to do. See ya. Again, the game's like, hmm, yeah, you just beat up a super villain who could fucking destroy, mm, destroy like concrete with his shock waves. You probably don't need any health after that. You're good. Is he is Spider Man dabbing? Kind of looks like it a little bit. Okay, now initiate reflex mode. Punch, punch, jump, and then... Just absolutely destroyed! Oh, I love that move so much. There we go, cleaning up the streets. You wish Spider-Man hung the thugs low enough for traffic to hit them. <laughs> Just to really stick it to them. Okay. I think it says vigilante, fan, vigilantism, quite like vehicular manslaughter. Yeah. Hey, I did just save this guy from falling, though. So, I mean, you know, I don't just kill criminals. You know, I, I help people. Huge crescent wrench. Yeah, I mean, they have comically large wrenches to beat me with, yeah. I don't know where they get them, but they do have them. What, what is this stuff? I don't think you want me to answer that question, sir. Here, I'm gonna take this guy. We're just gonna go behind here. There we go. And get the money. You just keep the money back. Yeah, yeah. I mean, how do you think? How do I, how do you think Peter Parker pays for his apartment? He goes to the cops and say, "I don't know what happened to the money. It just it just went away. I don't know where it happened. I don't know where it went." Peter, great timing. Jonah was just yelling for you. Go on in. <laughs> Thanks, Betty. You were looking for me, Mr. Jameson? Parker, where were you 15 minutes ago? There's a Latvian diplomat coming into the city by helicopter. He's landing any moment, and I need a photo. Now get over there like your job depended on it. Got it, Mr. Jameson. Oh, sorry about that, Mr. Jameson. Sometimes I just... Every once in a while. 
don't worry about it. Mysterio is probably one of the most difficult video game bosses in video game history. Like, it's gonna be tough. Yeah, the fish, the fish bowl dude guy, man. Yeah, him. Yeah, you know how Shocker only had one health bar? Just take a look at this guy. This is. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Okay. You have trifled with my power for the last time. I will not hold back. You face your doom today. Alright, let's approach him carefully. Okay, maybe we can talk this you can, Spider-Man. Don't make me immolate you where you stand. You have proven yourself a worthy foe, so I offer you this last chance to withdraw from the battlefield while you still can. Guys, do you think I should take that? It sounds like a pretty good offer. This is your last chance. Really? I'm warning you. Okay, guys. To a fault, but your time is running out. I don't know. This guy might be too tough. He's given me he's given me a way out. Oh, I can't leave. He locked the door. I can't I don't think I have a choice. I think I actually have to try and fight him. Okay. Alright, here we go. Holy shit. I can't believe I did that first try. Let me just shoot web at him real quick. Make sure he's really good inside up. Really spray the sticky icky all over him. There we go. I think he's good now. Alright, sir. You have a good day. And yeah, Mysterio, he he, he he renovated his entire apartment into a fun house. So yeah, he needed to, to pay some rent. What he really should have done instead of robbing a convenience store, he should have pretended to stop an armored vehicle from being robbed but then stole the money. That's how I do it. What kind of men work on a boat? Sailors. <laughs> you can't get me that easy. I have some photos you might want to see. Remember Quentin Beck? Turns out he was Mysterio. So, Beck and Spider-Man weren't cahoots all along. How can you look at those pictures and say that? I don't have time for your moral outrage, Parker. I'm trying to run a paper here and make sure my son's wedding to Jean Marie doesn't bankrupt me. Jean Marie. My name is Mary Jane. <laughs> yeah, right, right. I'll give you 200 for the lot. You can collect your money on your way out. Another I can't believe that. I'm really busy right Jameson now. Jameson would frame his own mother if he thought it would sell papers. So I'm just holding the camera just like this. And I don't know, this just is happening. go give the bugles a steam publisher a piece of my mind she's messed up my reputation long enough hey where's the fire i don't have time to talk i need to have a word with the publisher of the daily bugle whoa there mighty one take a deep breath that paper has turned half the city against me 
I'm sick and tired of it. <laughs> it was a pretty good joke, yeah. Well, I'm sure that bursting into the Beagle offices and yelling will clear everything up. All I'm saying is, you may want to calm down. <sighs> you seriously need to loosen up. Have more fun. You're a superhero. You, you swing through New York City in brightly colored tights. I like my costume. <laughs> the point is, here you are. This is Black Cat. Far beyond those of mortal men. And you're pouting on a rooftop. What's up with that? I guess you're right. What did you have in mind? Well, I did find Shocker again. And <laughs> I'm dying for some payback. Sounds good. <laughs> All right. Showtime, baby. Oh, okay. Oh, wow, damn. How the fuck did you get in? time you losers got here i must have told every low life in new york where to find me <laughs> a trap don't take it too hard cat shocker's a crafty one no wait i'm thinking of someone else get ready here comes the pain i hate it when he says that i'm gonna squish you like a bug Come on. Got him. <laughs> Holy shit. Was that as good for you as it was for me? I have to admit, you were right. I feel much better. You see? I told you, baby. Stick with me and you'll be fine. Come see me next time you're feeling down, alright? I'll see you around. She's pretty amazing, don't you think, Shock? <sighs> I think my career has just hit a new low. Ah, who cares what you think? We're gonna make it to Mary Jane's play this time, I feel it. Can't believe I missed it again. Damn it. Night, guys. See y'all tomorrow. What's up, Garly? Give me your money. Leave me alone. All right, I'm gonna make you watch me beat the shit out of him. <laughs> you okay? Yeah. Great timing. What are you doing here? You know me, always hanging around. I'm getting married. I don't know if you heard. Oh, really? What's he like? He's there. Oh. He loves me, and he's there. Those are the two things you need. I, uh, I, I have to get back to my patrol. See you around. Yeah, next time a bunch of thugs try to jump me. It's a date. Hey, what took you so long? Running late seems to be part of my idiom. You work too hard. It takes the mild manner to bring in the team. This life is so much more fun. Look at me. Sure, I can play hero if I want. But if I don't feel like it... <laughs> Give it a try. Take the weight of the world off your shoulders. You don't understand. You don't know why I do this. What? Parents got killed by a mugger? Abducted by aliens? Sold you to the circus? <laughs> it doesn't matter. Whatever the reasons, you can't change the past. What's done is done. You have to live for the present. Hippie. <laughs> All right, fine. Don't cheer up. All I'm saying is, you're gonna get an ulcer or something. I suppose, as usual, that you have the perfect thing to take my mind off my problems. Now that you mention it, there is a little something I know about. You know that warehouse on the west side near the convention center? Something big is going down. I'll race you there. All right, Moonbeam. You're on. Let's go. Moonbeam? Oh, wait, wait, we get to race. Sick. Finally. I've been waiting this whole time. I don't have to follow her. I can just go. She's so far behind, I couldn't even hear her. Oh, this building's going to be a problem, though.
Come on. Shit. Made it. Did I make it? Did I win? I don't know. Hey, Cat. <sighs> gonna race? Whew. You're a funny guy, Spider. Real funny. All right, let's get going. Nice leap. She zoomed on to that point. Yeah, she's. The, the developers didn't even care that she has a grappling hook. She's like, no, she's she's just there. Supposedly, whatever they're selling is a pretty big deal. If it's a pretty big deal, then I guess this is a pretty big deal. A bunch of guys in hard hats. Oh, I hate these fucking things. These things suck. Isn't this the guy from Yakuza? Oh, that was pretty sick. see you anymore hysterical blindness what oh nothing like that I just finally realized something I'm not like you I can't live the life that you do my powers came with a responsibility and I need the balance of a normal life being spider-man is who I am but being just me that's who I am too Let's skip ahead to the part where you ask if we can still be friends. Can we still be friends? <laughs> Don't sound so dejected. But once I cross your path, I'm not so easy to get rid of. Go. <laughs> Find your girl. That's what you want to do, right? You finally started listening to me. You're doing what you want. I... Thanks, Kat. See you around. Okay, so I think we're going to end things here. If you catch my drift.